When the students are engaging in the science practices, that's a very different classroom culture than a culture where the students are expected to raise their hands before they speak and to wait to be called upon. So one of the very important skills for a teacher trying to teach science by engaging students in practices is managing the classroom culture of discourse and how to ensure that it's not just the students who are quickest to speak or who have the loudest voices who get to lead the conversation, but the conversation is structured and supported in a way that every student's ideas get included in the conversation and students' uh, ideas are welcomed, whether they're expressed in fluent English or in hesitant English because the student is a language learner. The issue is the idea, not who's saying it, not their status in the room, not their language ability, not their reputation as knowing or not knowing science, but because thinking is expressing idea, because expressing your ideas helps you to think them through. Every student needs the opportunity to do that. And so the trick for the teacher is setting up situations and phenomena to discuss that engage all the students in the conversation.